Good evening, everyone. It's Thursday, 6.30. You know this, I'm just, that's my way of introducing this evening's workout. Okay, tonight we're doing um, a 20 minute full body circuit workout. Hope you're joining me. Give us a wave if you are. As always, let's get marching. Let's get jolly. You may not be in the mood for it, but after five minutes, I'm sure you'll be loving it. And after 20 minutes, you'll be loving it even more because you'll be able to go home and have go and have your tea. Okay, anyway, let's be babbling. Give your arms a circle. I do apologise if I'm babbling on in these videos. Um, I'm just saying whatever comes into my head at the moment. Okay. Nice big stretch. Whatever time of day you do this workout, do let me know that you're doing it. It'd be nice to hear from you. And if you've got any um, exercise that you'd like me to do during putting the workout, let me know too. I shall put them in, especially for you. Okay, so step in side to side. As with all the um, workouts I'm doing, listen. do listen to your body. If there's an exercise that feels uncomfortable for whatever reason, don't do it. Do something different instead. Do something that you know you like doing or you know you can do. Okay, don't want any injuries. Okay, just raise your arms to the side. But you take it into a really big, slow it down and really take your time to get into a big side step here. Good, hope you're all fit and well this evening. I've had a traumatic afternoon of going around Asda, getting confused with the one way system. But it's done now, I've got food in the cupboard again. Okay, just taking your arms up nice and high, twisting round, tapping the outside of your leg. Good work. Nice big stretch in between. Four more of these. Two, one, and we'll just do some nice slow stretches and um, squats and stretches. Getting your hips nice and deep into them, keeping your shoulders back. Real big stretch. So tonight, if you've got a weight, brilliant. You only actually need one weight. How heavy that weight is, is completely up to you. If you've not got a weight, don't worry. You can still do the exercises. Okay, we're gonna be doing, if you keep marching on the spot, I'll tell you what we're doing. It's gonna be an awful lot of squats in various um, stages. So the first exercise, keep marching and I'll give you a run through. Getting your weight between your feet. Okay, we're doing single squat press. If you've not got a weight, just use an imaginary weight, okay? You're pressing up, you're going down, you're keeping your shoulders back, you're switching over, okay? If you've not got a weight, just pretend you have one of those ones. No problem, I'll pick up something that you can grab a hold of that you're not gonna drop on your head. Okay, next exercise we'll do after that would be hands under your shoulders, hand plank position, twisting round and alternating between side to side. You can do those on your knees or your toes. Third exercise, you want to take your feet really wide. Um, yeah, hold on to the weight. You're bending to one side. So in this position, you push your bum right back, but keeping your shoulders back. So you'll be working your glute here and your inner thigh here, okay? It's really important you bend that leg. We're going to add a press into that as well, alternating sides. Then we're going to go down and do some crunches, you all know what they are. And then we're going to do some kettlebell swings using a dumbbell or if you've got a kettlebell, you can use a kettlebell. Okay, again, if you've not got a weight, you can pick something up or imagine you've got a weight. No problem, you'll still be working either way. Okay, we're going to do 40 seconds of each, 20 seconds rest in between. Hoist your leggings up everybody. We're going to start with those. Single squat presses, how are we all ready? Deep breath, 40 seconds, let's go. Pressing it up, nice strong press. Do remember to keep your shoulders back as you switch over. Put the weight right down and then pick it up on your other hand. So you get a little bit of a double pulse at the bottom of your squat here. Good, nice strong weight, nice strong press. If you do it the first round and it's really easy, if you've got heavy weight, use your heavy weight. Good stuff, nice and strong. Keep your tummy pulled in, last 10 seconds. Switch it over. Shoulder back, good. Excellent, last one. And strong press, well done. Okay, put your weight to the side, you don't need it. For the next exercise, hand plank. 
plank. Make sure your hands are under your shoulders. Okay, holding that position strong. Hips down, abs in tight. Do this on your knees if you want, and off we go. So opening that chest out. We're doing 40 seconds of each exercise. Three rounds. Okay, I'm just kicking my weight to the side. So when you're opening, you're lifting your arm up, really open your chest. Twist round. Watch your bones not come up in the air. Good. And it's a nice controlled movement. So slowly bring it down each time. You're working your shoulders, your hips, and your abs. All of these exercises, you're working your full body. All of them crunches. Not so much. Open that chest. And we'll do one more. Nice wide arm. And back down again. Okay, back onto your feet. This time you're taking your feet really wide, okay? Don't do splits or anything here, but nice and wide so you can get a really good feel it down your inner thigh, but make sure you're pushing your bum back on each one. Okay, pick up your weight. Let's go. You don't have to add a press in here. You can just move from one side to another. Make sure you're getting really deep here, then squeezing and pushing as you come up each time. So you feel it in your glute on one side and your inner thigh on the other. Good, nice and strong. Well done, good, good press each time. Breathe deep and press. Good, two more of these. Excellent, and last one. Strong press, good work. Put your weight down, grab your mat if you have one, or onto the floor. Whichever is best for you. We'll do basic crunches. As we're using your full body for everything else, we'll just focus um, just on the ab squeeze here. Okay, but really do squeeze. Okay, 40 seconds, off we go. Good, so squeeze them. I'm gonna show, actually, I am gonna show you a variation of these. So if you want, you can take your feet up off your floor and push them out using your legs if you want as well. It's up to you, but you've still got to get that crunching, lifting your shoulders, strong push out. It'll work your full body, this variation. If you're after the full body for every exercise, failing that, keep your feet on the floor. Just keep crunching, lifting with your shoulders. And last one. Good stuff. Okay, onto your feet again. I do say slowly onto your feet and then I jump up. I'm aware of that. I'm sorry about that. Okay, shoulders back. Be careful if you get a bit of head rush now and again. Don't get too quick on your feet. So this one, you turn your toes slightly outward. I'll show you from the side. Shoulders back, dumbbell out, and off you go. Now you don't want to take it right above your head. You want to take it to about curving height. But well, keep your shoulders back, your arms straight and strong, good, and keep pushing through your heels all the time, good, you've got that slight push forward in your hips when you rise, make sure your arms are still straight, we'll do two more, last one, and rest it there. Just be careful when you're bringing that weight down. Okay, that was quite an easy round. I'm gonna get a bit heavier. If you've got heavier weight, feel free to do it. We're back to round two. So we're starting with the single squat presses, a hoist up of the leggings, weight between your feet, and let's go. Pressing, strong press each time, keeping your shoulders back. I'm working a bit harder tonight because I've not actually been out for a run today or a walk yet. Hoping to go after this. So I've got a bit of unused energy. Good, strong press. Remember, don't drop your shoulders forward. And keep switching over arms. Use your legs for that press to push up each time. Make sure it's a smooth movement. Last couple. Big press, good. And last one, press. Well done, put your weight down. And onto 
your hands and toes, knees if you need to, and the edge of the settees if you need to as well, if you want your arms raised. Okay, onto your toes, abs strong, hips down, off we go, controlled movement, opening your arm and chest out as much as you can, going for that twist. But keeping it strong as you bring your arm down. You should feel this twist. Nice deep breath. Good work. I'm liking tonight's circuit. I hope you are. I don't like all of them, you know. I didn't like the other nights. Good. Breathe deep. Open your chest. And this will be your last one. Open and control it down. Good work, okay, onto your feet again, you're taking your feet really wide, starting with the weight in your hands here. So nice and wide, remember, push your hips right back on each move. Okay, we're taking it down to the floor, pressing it up is an option, okay. Pressing, good. If you don't wanna have the presses, just keep it to the side and come up, okay. But make sure you're pushing your hips back. You can add that press if you want to. Good, nice strong press each time. Your inner thigh, your adductor muscle. You should be feeling it in there. Good work, nice and strong. Really press them out if you're doing the presses. Good, squeeze those glutes each time you push up. Your weight should be in your heels for all of these. And last one. Pressing, good. Well done. Put your weight down and we're on the crunches. So, yeah, I'll give you two options in the last round. So either your basic crunches, your feet on the floor, or you can lift your legs up into this position. You can either do these extensions single or double. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna do them double. If you're doing them single, just press out the important bit of these is that crunch of your shoulders each time. Ooh, see my voice is going. <laughs> Breathe, keep breathing. I'm just shuffling back, carry on everybody. I was hitting the, hitting the door again. That's it, crunching up, breathing deep. Hang in there if you're doing the full crunches. Keep going with them. Last one, crunch it. And rest it there. Excellent. Okay. Hey, we're nearly round, round two. Okay, we're doing the kettlebell swings. I'll show you from a side view again. Just watch those shoulders back. You're keeping your back and your abs strong in everything we do tonight, okay? To support your core muscles, okay? We're working them. Off we go. I'm chatting. We started a little bit late for this one. Good, so really sit into it, push your hips back and squeeze your bum as you push forward. Watch those arms are straight and strong. Good work, keep it going. Nice, strong presses, swings. What we're we doing, string the pressing. Whew, confusing. Good, last couple. Strong back and last one. Well done. Careful when you bring the weight down there. Good. We've done two rounds. We're going to do one more. Do you know what the hell? I'm going to go a bit heavier. I might, I might regret this. You might see me, well, I was going to say huffing and puffing. I'm also huffing and puffing. You might see, see me swearing in this one. Okay. Are we ready to go? Final round. 40 seconds of each. Single squat presses to start. Let's go. Whew. Well, that's a clatter. <laughs> Should have put Matt down. Never mind. Close your ears to the clatter of the dumbbell. Okay, press them out, everyone. Good, nice strong rope. Tummy pulled in. Power up that arm each time. Good stuff. Nearly there. And this will be your last one. Well done. Good stuff. Whew, felt that. Okay, on to hand plank. 
knees on toes. You can have your hands raised if you need to. We're going for that slow, strong, controlled twist. Hands under your shoulders and off we go. Good, so open that chest out. Keep your tummy pulled in. If you've got your tummy muscles engaged, then they're gonna be working all the time. If you're letting it all hang out, they're not working as hard. You may as well use all your muscles you can. Good stuff, keep it going nice and strong. Open that chest out. Reaching round. Good, keep that control as you come down each time. And this will be your last one. Twist and round. Good work, okay, three more to go. Nice wide feet on these ones. So hips are nice and low, give your shoulder roll. If you need to, remember the press is optional each time. Are we ready? Off we go, so down here and pressing up strong. Good work. If you've got a selection of weights, never be frightened to go for the heavier weight. You may as well give it a try. You can always swap down again. Good, power them out, hips back. Keep those shoulders back too. Nice, strong presses. Good work, keep it going. We're nearly there on these. Good press, last couple. And last one, big press. Well done. Put the weight to the side. We're on the mat for crunches, two more to go. Time's flying tonight. Don't feel like we've been doing this long, does it? You might think differently. Okay, so crunches, or full crunches, it's up to you. Let's go, lifting your shoulders. Good, it helps if you breathe out when you lift up. You can expel all the air from your lungs. Good stuff, go for it. If you're crunching with your feet on the floor, go for it, lifting with your shoulders each time. Good work everyone, keep it strong. I'm gonna do three more. Two, and last one. Well done. Whew, okay, on to your feet for the final time. We're gonna do our last exercise, 40 seconds of the swings. Are you with me? I'll face the camera. Oh, you'll see my funny facial expressions. Shoulders back. Body strong, let's go. Last 40 seconds with the weights or without the weights. Last 40 seconds of these. Good, watch your shoulders out going forward. Keep them lifted, keep your tummy pulled in. Push through your heels. Good, keep them strong, got 20 seconds to go. Well done everyone, hang in there. Finish strong. Good work, nearly there. We'll do three more. Two more. And last one. And slowly bring the weight down there. Good work. Put your weight to your side, to the side. And give your arms and legs a shake. Um, I really enjoyed that. I hope you did too, let me know. Um, give your shoulders roll, we'll have a bit of a stretch to finish. Okay, so hamstring stretch. You should know these stretches by now. Push your hips back, keep your shoulders back. You can reach down to increase that stretch a little bit more. Nice deep breaths. and switch on to the other side. We're already holding these stretches about 15 seconds, which is probably about the minimum you should hold a stretch for. So do feel free to do some more stretches afterwards. Or if you're finding certain parts of your body are aching more than others, you know to do a few more extra stretches with them. 
Okay, knees together, push your hips forward, keep your shoulders back. Well, I don't know about you, but I feel blooming great now um, after doing that workout. I'm glad it's not raining here. I'm gonna go for a walk, power it out with the dog, see how energetic she's feeling. Switch onto the side. Are you all doing your run? Are you all trying to get out every day? Hope so. A bit of fresh air is really good for you as well. Good for your mental health, that's really important. Exercise is great for your mental health, but getting outside and doing it is brilliant as well. Okay, pushing your arms forward, stretching between your shoulder blades. Again, big breath. And then reach your mouth, pushing your chest out. These stretches that we that I do most of the time are the, the covering all your main the main muscles in your body. So the basic stretches um, that you should be able to gauge how much you're stretching yourself. There are some other fancy stretches. I'm going to do a live stretch video again on Sunday. Um, I'm going to put some other stretches in there as well that you can also do. Okay, just push back into your heel, bend into your front leg, and just stretch your shoulder. We've done a little bit of pressing tonight with the dumbbells. Oh, without, we've done lots of arm raising. Again, breathe deep. And then switch onto the side, push that heel back, take your arm across and breathe nice and deeply. Good stuff, everybody. Give your shoulders a roll, your arms and legs a shake. You should be feeling really proud of yourself tonight. I hope so. We'll finish with a reach down. Breathing out. Big breath in, big stretch. And slowly bring your arms down. Good work, everybody. I'm back here at 8 o'clock in the morning for 10 minutes of morning motivation. I'm also here um, tomorrow evening. We'll do another circuit tomorrow evening. Not sure what it'll be yet. You'll just have to wait and see, unless you give me some suggestions. Okay, have a great evening everybody and I will see you in the morning. Bye for now.